For almost four decades now, the incredible St. Alphonsus Festival of Trees has kicked off the holiday season here in the Treasure Valley. It's really a Thanksgiving staple for so many families. That's right. We had to go without it last year. It's terrible, but it's back. It's an event that raises funds for the Neurosurgical Trauma Intensive Care Unit for St. Alphonsus. Yes. And there to tell us about this joyful event, Brenda Rodriguez. Brenda, how's it going? It is going fantastic out here. And just like you mentioned, Justin, we are back able to do this again in person. And that's what makes this weekend that much more special because we can all come together once again to enjoy this beautiful scenery and just get into the holiday spirit. And to talk to us a little bit more about this event is both Rebecca and Tim. Uh, they're both the co-chairs for the Festival of Trees. Thank you so much for, for uh, talking to us this morning. But tell me, what are we doing here, Tim? Oh, we're raising a lot of money for St. Al's and the new uh, tr uh, Neurosurgical, Neurosurgical Trauma, Trauma Intensive <laughs> Care Unit. Unit. It's a mouthful. mouthful. There you go. <laughs> I mean, Rebecca, we are standing on such a beautiful piece right now, but there's a theme this year. Tell there me is. a little bit more about the theme. So the theme is Let There Be Light. And I actually came up with it in January of 2020 because these things take a long time to plan. And now it couldn't be more appropriate with everything we've gone through out of the darkness into the light. So what can people expect this year? Oh gosh, we have so many things, especially for the children. We've got North Pole Village, Talking Tree, of course, visits with Santa, um, a Lego display, a train display, arts and crafts, an art contest. I, it just goes on and on. Yeah. Dance troupe entertainers. Oh, yes. uh, you fire. have it all here for we sure. Do. Well, you said you mentioned these trees are decorated by the sponsors um, and to kick everything off is tonight. tonight. What's happening tonight? Tonight's the gala. Uh, the big gala. Yes. Yep. What can people expect for that? So we have a thousand people coming and we bid on about 10 of the trees in a live auction and then after that all of these trees will be online for purchase so people can go online and bid on them all weekend long through Saturday. Well you mentioned a lot of people come through these doors every single season but you also mentioned that tickets are going to look a little bit different this year. Can yes. you talk about that? Yes so we have online ticket sales at stalfonsesorg slash festival and just it's really important to note it takes 3,000 volunteers to put this wow. event on. Wow, that's a lot of volunteers, a lot of, and it just makes it that much more special out here. We can come together and enjoy this beautiful um, event. I mean, Tim, you also mentioned there's a lot of kid events this uh, for, for this season. So next hour or in a couple uh, of minutes here, we're going to talk or take you guys into the village where kids can enjoy. So maybe you can take Excellent. me there for oh, sure. Yeah, it's going to be great.